I not quitting. Doug Vigil says the message left outside his home Sunday morning may have hurt his feelings. It made me feel awful. I was crying. I was very um, in tear when I saw that happen to me. But it won't stop him from running for the Stockton School Board. Vigil was born without ears, but after years of reconstructive surgery and hearing aids, he can now hear better. This is what was left on his walkway. No special ed on board. And they misspelled it. That was an idiot. The word quit was also spray painted on his notary sign he keeps in the yard. Neighbors say the message targets his disability, not his ability to be a good board leader. I'm not running for city councilman, it's a school board. I'm trying to advocate parents that your kid is not broken. They, have a, they could do whatever they want to do. Vigil has been an advocate for people with disabilities for years. He was instrumental in getting signers at public city meetings and wants to continue his work within the school system. You, sh you shouldn't be a target just because that you're running for office. And this is a perfectly nice guy that has never done anything to anybody except teach sign language and he's a, he's a member of our civil service commission. <laughs> Mayor Anthony Silva helped scrub and power wash the graffiti this morning, and another group painted the sidewalk red. That's disgusting, it's sickening, and we're just not going to tolerate it in Stockton. And neither is Vigil. He'll continue his campaign, he says, with the same positive spirit. I'm not a, a career politician. I'm trying to advocate the right of pre, uh, prejudice against people with less that are disability. They're not disabilities. Just because they're, they're, they're blind, they're deaf, they're on wheelchair, they can do whatever they want their heart desire. In Stockton, Dana Griffin, KCRA 3 News.